Hi guys, this is Julie and Christina. And, oh, let me do this again. <laughs> Hi guys, this is Julie and my friend Christina. And we're here at Michael's. And we're on a hunt to buy some fondant so that we can make bee cupcakes. You'll see what we're talking about. But it's gonna be an adventure because we never worked with it before. <laughs> I'm very awkward on camera. <laughs> and Christina's being such a good sport because she's willing to be filmed right now even though she doesn't feel so great because she's actually prego. But she's such a good friend that she's willing to vlog with me. I'm so. for Julie. <laughs> making uh, bumblebees and these are gonna be the bumblebee wings. Yeah, we're doing this whole bumblebee thing for a baby shower for one of our friends. We got three of these yellow guys for the bodies because that takes up the most amount of fondant. And then I think I'm gonna cut stripes out of this flat sugar sheet and put that on top of the body. So it's just one sheet, but we think that should be enough. And then we got one white sheet for the wings. And then for the ones that we don't have bees, we're gonna get these little daisy things. That should be good. And then I already bought cupcake wrappers, so it works out. We made a side trip to ShopRite, drinking our iced coffee because we're sleepy and we just need to get a few things. I forgot eggs. Can't make cupcakes without eggs, so. This is what we're putting inside our cupcakes. <laughs> just kidding. What are you making? Chili. What kind of chili? Regular chili. <laughs> <laughs> Joe was finally making a cameo, probably wondering where he was. He was sitting here at Christina and Jason's place, but at least he was doing work, right? Of course I, I am. I'm always doing work. Air quote time, work. It's kind of crazy in here because Christina and Jason are busy making their chili for guests that are coming over. I just made cake mix cake. I would have done from scratch, but there were just way too many steps, including trying to figure out how to make the bees. So I'm about to plop that in here. And then we're gonna put some salsa inside it. Hey, <laughs> hey, just kidding. My cupcake wrappers have tiny little bees on them, which are so fitting for our theme. He is working. He actually just uploaded our next video, which by the time you see this vlog will probably already be up. Which one is this? It's the Easy Shrimp Pad Thai. Good job. You get a high five. Good job, Bella. Bella brings all the boys to the yard. This is on the campus of Jason. What is this petty private school? <laughs> it's a boarding school. It's a boarding school, and Jason's a teacher here. And they live on campus. Isn't that nice? I figured since I used box mix for the cupcakes, I might as well step it up a notch and make my own frosting. So we just have two sticks of unsalted softened butter and some cream cheese. And then we're just going to add powdered sugar, vanilla extract, and a little bit of lemon zest. Okay, so now it's finally time to try to attempt using fondant. I'm really pressing and squeezing hard, but it won't soften. So I popped it into the microwave. It cracked in half because it's dry and brittle, but I looked up online and that's kind of normal. So I'm trying to use the heat of my hands to kind of make it more moldable like Play-Doh. It's so much easier to just rip off little chunks of it while it crumbles and then work on that small ball piece. But these are our bodies for the bees that we've made. We made sure that they were just kind of even in thickness and just flat on the bottom so they can rest easily. This is 23 bodies and we used one and a half packs of this. This is what the sugar sheet looks like when you first take it out. It's flatter than we even expected. I pretty much cut out a chunk, just use scissors. I tried using a pizza cutter but it wasn't sharp enough and I just kind of eyeballed it. I didn't even really measure it too precisely. How do you think it's going? I think it's going out well so far. <laughs> Yeah. It's hard to get it exact. Some are skinny, some are fat, but that looks charming, I think. Now they don't look like weird fat Cheetos anymore. Christina is using the end of a piping tip and trying to wiggle out little small eyes. Look at this. Tiny little eyes. We recruited a new member. I lost an eyeball. <laughs> <laughs> this is how we attach the stripes. Dip it in water with a little Q-tip. Then take out the tiny skinny little sliver and then you wrap it all the way around and trim off the excess. Not easy. I'm pretty tired right now. But Joe did such a fantastic job that they went from looking like they had regular eyeballs to looking like they had bleeding eyes or sunglasses. <laughs> and then we recruited another person, <laughs> Jason. And he's putting the eyeballs on 
with a little toothpick. I am cutting out the white wings as a little flat heart by hand. Mm -hmm. What do you think? I like it. That's what I gotta do times 20 something times. I'm making little bumblebees and then I'm gonna make glitter wings too. Cute. This is for the onesie line. It's basically gonna be like a little clothing line mm -hmm. um, with onesies and a couple hats and little mittens. Good idea to put the little things on there too, a little accent. Yeah, it just gives it a little playful effect. Mm -hmm. I was joking around that we should have put that on our cupcakes and <laughs> called it a day, right? <laughs> on a toothpick and stuck it in. That would have been good. So the hearts are all cut out. It didn't take too, too long. I must be a glutton for punishment because it's past midnight. Um, by the way, we're sleeping over Christine and Jason's place. So with all these little scraps, I decided to make a little stinger. But I think that actually makes it complete. It's past one o'clock in the morning. <laughs> we're so greasy, tired, disheveled, and delirious. Before we go to sleep, we have to fix the cake that we purchased from the professional baker. A lot of things are kind of falling off right now, so uh, we just gotta fix it. Now pregnant lady is on the floor. One of these wings fell off, and then these little beads all around are falling off. We just fashioned a glue together with powdered sugar and water, and individually hand placing these beads back on. It's almost two o'clock in the morning. I'm not getting sleep tonight. Mm -hmm. And we gotta wake up by like six something. We touch one bead and all of them fall off. So we're just taking them all off and putting them all back on. And Joe's up all night because I'm up all night because he's waiting for me to be done with the vlog and he can put it up on the computer. <laughs> what a tiring night. Our wing from the cake actually stayed on that we glued, but guess what? The other wing popped off. Christina is delicately putting the other wing back on. Oh, look. Who's that outside? <laughs> Hello. Good morning. It's a beautiful day outside, though. It is. Great day for a baby shower. So we're loading up the car and we're heading out a little bit earlier because not only do we have to set up so we have to get there early, but we're actually gonna go film another vlog right now in Edgewater, New Jersey, which is the place we lived in when we first got married. So we wanna do a little walk down memory lane vlog. Look at Bella the Bee. Bella the Bee and Uncle Joe. We're gonna head out. Say bye, Bella. Bye. Bye, Bella. Yeah. That is super cute. Yeah. That is so working on this. Oh, you need help? They're preparing the cupcakes, the cakes, the other decorations. <laughs> um, it was a little crazy when I first got here. I'm just frosting the cupcakes with a butter knife because I didn't have piping tips. So we got some bees with yellow sprinkles and some daisies with green sprinkles. Christina's bees and clothesline she worked on last night. I like how some of the bees are partying this way with their wings in the back and then some of them are flapping forward. So the cupcakes actually look really good with, along with the cake. These are diaper army booties because Shauna's husband is in the army. It's a diaper bike. Look at this view. The final table. Just waiting for the guest of honor. Guest of honor, Sean is here. Hi. Oh my gosh, look at this. It's so pretty. Yay. Yay. Yeah, he was in Afghanistan. Oh. Aww. How's Kuwait? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry you couldn't be here. He's like, eh. That's for you guys. Timed or is it the best? You all have quality? Both. Do you want quality or quantity? Because I can do a lot of quality. Quality or quantity? Where's the front? Where's the front? You guys got 30 seconds. 30 seconds. In one, two, three.
Thanks for the shout out. Aww. Small bites on the boat. I think that the cupcakes, the cake, and the table in general, and the whole room came out really nice. So I think it was worth it to stay up all night. But, anyways, I hope you enjoyed watching this video. And if you did, remember to push like, leave a comment down, no. <laughs> and subscribe to our channel. Thanks so much for watching. See you next time. Bye. Bye. See you next time. <laughs> Joe doesn't even know the <laughs> <laughs> Oh, it's done. <laughs>